Hey guys, and thank you so much for tuning into my channel. My name is The Lady Designer, and we are here with all the screenshots so far from the Tropical Pack. You probably already heard that the Tropical Pack is launching on the 4th of April of this year. You probably already seen the trailer. I just uploaded a video with a trailer breakdown so if you're interested in that definitely go and check that video out i also give a little bit of my opinion about this new pack but as also mentioned in that video i did not have the screenshots yet that were about to be posted on steam so that is why we are making this separate video with all the screenshots that we have so far so as you can see right over here this is the beautiful temple theme or building set that we are getting with the tropical pack and also, I actually just noticed that this is probably made with the null path. So right now you can just build your own sandy path, for example, with like these rocks around it. I think this looks absolutely fantastic. I think having null path is going to be so game changing for a lot of us builders out there but that like the null path is obviously not part of the tropical pack but it will be free in free update 1.13 but talking about this temple itself i think this building set is definitely going to be super amazing i absolutely love the fact that it has like this mossy vibe to it as well also really do like these vines right over here they look super beautiful and right over here we see this other building set i i wonder if this is maybe like an extension to like the indian pieces that we have in the game like you know those yellow colored pieces like just like the africa pack we got like this extra set of building pieces with the plaster pieces i could see this potentially being like the same time of type of textures and stuff but obviously i'm just guessing right over here but nonetheless i think these pieces are going to be absolutely amazing for a lot of these tropical vibe zoos that we're going to build with this this theme absolutely love these type of pieces i think this is definitely one of my most favorite pack when it comes down to the pieces also right over here i do feel like there are some type of new plants right over here which i do like i love i love this plant right over here also see something sticking out right over here i'm not entirely sure if i'm able to like i can't really zoom in that much so it is what it is but uh this definitely looks very beautiful and i think this is also part of the new scenario or was it the career Mo map that they're going to add with this pack as well so yeah definitely a very very beautiful map and beautiful architecture and then right over here we have the gibbons and we already saw them in the trailer but man these guys look so beautiful i really do like it i really love how they are made and the fact that there are like different color variations to these animals i absolutely love here we see the same type of architecture pieces again with the orange color. I do really like it. I'm very interested to see more of this one. And I do hope, I'm assuming that everything is recolorable. Although I don't really know about the stone set. I don't really think that the stone in the game is recolorable unless they did change it recently. Well, we have to see about that. Look at this one walking over the vines, by the way. And uh, yeah, well, we know the hanging animation, so that is obviously super cool. So I do really love that. The next screenshot is also from the new career scenario. And you can tell right over here that someone really did their best to create these beautiful temples and architecture. It looks really good. Right over here, we can also get a glimpse of the new Asian water monitor, but it's a little bit too far away to actually tell. But yeah, the building theme is definitely super interesting. And then right over here, we have another one. Oh, I actually do think that this bicycle looks new. I do hope that these little pieces will be separate and not like one big piece, but we have to wait and see about that. Also, like... Is it just me? Like, I know that we have, like, these leaf patches now with the um, Twilight pack. But is that this? Or are they going to add, like, different terrain type? I doubt it. I doubt it. I, I think these are the leaf patches of 
the Twilight pack that they use, but I, I, I do feel like it works super well, actually. Even in this tropical biome, I actually wouldn't really think of using that, but I think it looks really good. We also got a really good glimpse here now of these beautiful roof pieces right over here, and even the textures on top of it. I think that really looks fantastic. Also right over here, I, I, I do think that you can recolor this to, to give it your own twist. So that looks really good. I do really hope that this is not like one. I mean, they probably just built these shops and then duplicated it. I do really hope that this is like separate in some way or, or even like separate pieces entirely so you can still create your own barriers or like like how you say that like the beams and stuff and then right over here we see another uh beautiful building I, I think it looks absolutely fantastic really really do love the architecture and then right over here it's the red river hog and <laughs> I, I have to admit, like, I wasn't super enthusiastic about these animals in my previous two videos. <laughs> but if I look at these, this picture right over here, the interactions with these two is just absolutely adorable. And this big smile, I mean, come on, okay. Even, even I wasn't super excited about these guys, but I am a huge fan of the warthogs. I mean, okay, they, they... He can become one of my favorites now. I mean, this is just hilarious. The only only thing is that I feel like I wish like with any type of animal that looks like each other, like the bungos and you have Nialas or like the warthogs and then the babirusa and then probably also this uh, red river hog that they have the same um, audio sounds. So there is not much difference into these type of animals and that is something I, I wish Frontier would still work on so that every animal has really their own unique sounds even though it might be very similar that it's still a little bit different so I, I do hope that they did not just use the audio of the warthogs again for this animal because I, I don't know I think it just would give them so much more personality if they would be having their own unique audio even though it would look similar you know what I mean okay enough about the audio I mean these guys look look really really adorable and just very very beautiful i i i already love them secretly <laughs> i'm just a huge fan of this picture it makes me smile so much and right over here we can see a little bit more it actually does look like a lot of the uh, uh, bricks i i for some reason i did i don't really feel much about breaks, but I, I guess it's something they really took from the architecture. So I guess it's it's totally normal to see it as a break, but I, I kind of felt like it would be more like plaster or like I said, like the Indian theme, the, the materials from that. But I don't know. I'm just very curious to see more about this this building set into the game. Oh, and if you're interested in grabbing this pack, our channel is sponsored by Instant Gaming and via their website, you can get Planet Zoo and all packs, including this new tropical pack on launch day with a really nice discount. Obviously, next to that, you can also find other cool games like The Sims, City Skylines, Jurassic World Evolution, Farming Simulator, and so many others with a really nice discount. And by buying via the website, you will get a great discount and you will also be supporting the channel. So definitely keep an eye out to their website to get the new tropical pack or any other pack you want with a really nice discount. I will make sure to put the link to their website in the description of this video and in the pinned message of the comment section so you can easily find it. So yeah, these were all the screenshots so far. Please do let me know in the comments down below what you guys all think of the tropical pack that has just been announced. This cute picture of the Red River Hog and the Little Piglet. Do let me know in the comments down below. Leave a like at the video if you guys enjoyed. Subscribe, of course, if you haven't already. And yeah, I just really do hope to see you guys on the next one. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye, guys!